Is it the right time to buy or sell Exxon stock? In this video, we'll be taking a deep dive into Exxon. Our initial report was published on our website on Monday, December 18, 2023. And now, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You wouldn't want to miss any critical updates that could impact your investments. Improve your trading decisions with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 on stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since December 18, 2023, our system has ranked Exxon as a hold slash accumulate and has given it a score of minus 0.42. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance during this period. Although the stock has experienced some fluctuations, it is currently at a loss of 0% since our initial hold slash accumulate recommendation. The stock is currently experiencing a downward trend in the short term, indicating the possibility of further decline. Based on the current three-month trend, there is a projected minus 14.41% change over the next three months, with potential returns ranging between minus 18.39% and minus 12.35%. Looking at the 12-month trend, there is a projected minus 4.49% change over the next year, with potential returns ranging between minus 10.18% and 11.73%. This suggests a price range of $91.30 to $113.58 after one year. Our latest update on Exxon's stock price reveals a stronger technical forecast following Monday's trading session. On Monday, December 18, 2023, Exxon stock price increased by 0.743%, going from $100.90 to $101.65. Throughout the day, the stock fluctuated between a low of $101.52 and a high of $103.11, experiencing a 1.57% variation. Over the past two weeks, there has been a decrease of 0.76%. Additionally, Trading volume decreased by 6 million shares on the last day, with a total of 19 million shares traded for approximately $1.89 billion. It's important to note that a decrease in volume at higher prices can indicate divergence and potentially signal future changes in the coming days. Over the past 52 weeks, Exxon stock reached a high of $126.54 and a low of $97.49. Currently, the price is 19.67%, or $24.89, below its 52-week high of $126.54, which is also the stock's all-time high. Today, let's take a look at some recent analyst ratings for ExxonMobil. On Friday, November 10, 2023, Piper Sandler gave ExxonMobil an overweight grade with a hold action. On Thursday, November 2, 2023, Bernstein gave ExxonMobil an outperform grade with a hold action. On Friday, October 27, 2023, CFRA gave ExxonMobil a buy grade with an upgrade action. On Friday, October 27, 2023, Bernstein gave ExxonMobil an outperform grade with an initialize action. On Friday, October 27, 2023, Wells Fargo gave ExxonMobil an overweight grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Exxon stock a general rating of strong buy. They consider the P-E ratio and price to book as both strong buy. However, for return on investment, the analysts have given the stock a rating of neutral. Today, we'll be discussing the signals for Exxon stock. Currently, there are mixed signals for Exxon. The short-term moving average suggests a buy signal, while the long-term average indicates a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average, the overall forecast for the stock leans towards negativity. If the stock sees further gains, it is likely to face resistance at the long-term moving average of $103.10. On the other hand, if it falls, there is some support at the short-term average of $100.04. A break above the long-term average would provide another buy signal, 
while a fall below the short-term average would reinforce the sell signal. Additionally, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, currently suggests a sell signal. On Tuesday, December 12, 2023, a buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point, resulting in a 3.67% increase so far. This indicates a potential for further rise until a new top pivot is identified. However, it's important to note that volume fell during the last trading day despite the price gains. This creates a divergence between volume and price, which could be an early warning sign. Therefore, it is advisable to closely monitor the stock's performance. Here are some other signals that may catch your interest. The moving average convergence divergence indicates a sell signal. Pivots show a buy signal from 5 days ago. Bollinger also shows a buy signal from 5 days ago. The short-term moving average displays a buy signal from 4 days ago. The long-term moving average indicates a sell signal from 54 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 51 days ago. Now, let's analyze the 12-month chart. The short moving average displays a buy signal from 33 days ago. The long-term moving average also shows a buy signal from 33 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 33 days ago. For more signals, visit our page at stockinvest.us. In this video, we'll be discussing support, risk, and stop loss for Exxon. Let's start with support. Exxon currently has support from accumulated volume at $101.58. This means that when the stock price reaches this level, we can expect a buying opportunity as there may be an upwards reaction. Moving on to risk, Exxon is typically traded at a good volume and experiences minor daily changes. Therefore, the risk associated with this stock is considered to be low. In terms of recent volatility, the stock has had an average daily volatility of 1.46% over the past week. This indicates that it has been relatively stable in terms of price fluctuations. Before we explore potential trading levels for Exxon, let's start by covering some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, also known as the P-E ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. A lower P-E ratio may suggest low expectations for the company's future or indicate that the stock is undervalued, presenting a possible buying opportunity. Moving on, we have an upcoming earnings report for Q4 2023, scheduled for Jan 30, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report stand at $2.21. It's important to keep a close watch on these numbers as they can significantly impact stock prices. Let's now analyze some potential day trading levels for Exxon. In the event of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Exxon is at $106.47. If you don't currently own any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those who already hold the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Exxon faces its initial support level at $101.58. If this support level holds, it could serve as a favorable entry point, with the expectation of a rebound. The combined average rating for Exxon from multiple analyst sources is strong buy. Now, let's dive into some recent insider trades. On December 4, 2023, Karen T. McKee conducted an insider sell of 4,548 shares of common stock. On December 4, 2023, Liam M. Mallon conducted an insider sell of 7,693 shares of common stock. On December 4, 2023, John M. Gibbs conducted an insider sell of 2,076 shares of common stock. On December 4, 2023, Leonard M. Fox conducted an insider sell of 4,880 shares of common stock. On December 4, 2023, Darren L. Talley conducted an insider sell of 1,783 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 27.526. Overall, 
insiders purchased 16,590,832 shares and sold 2,311,531 shares in the last 100 trades. For this stock, we recommend setting the stop loss at $97.09, .09, which is a decrease of 4.49%. This stock has relatively stable daily movements, resulting in lower risk for investors. Additionally, we have identified a buy signal from a pivot bottom that occurred four days ago. Is Exxon stock a good buy? While Exxon holds several positive signals, we don't believe they are enough to consider it a buy candidate. At its current level, it should be seen as a hold candidate, meaning you should hold or accumulate shares while waiting for further development. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a hold slash accumulate candidate. Our systems have determined that the current price is undervalued based on the volatility and movements observed in the last trading day. For trading on Tuesday, December 19th, we expect Exxon to open up at $102.09, an increase of $0.443 from the previous close. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss. Always consult a qualified financial advisor before making any buying or selling decisions regarding securities. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing the information provided, you acknowledge and accept full responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to our stock analysis. Today, we want to hear your opinion. Share your thoughts by commenting below. We'd love to know your target for this stock. And if you enjoy our content, remember to like and subscribe. We're here at Stock Invest, wishing you successful trading and hoping you have a wonderful day.